Hello guys, my name is Kuna Wukin once again to another episode of Terraria and it's over. It's finally over and I survived it. I survived the exam weeks at my fucking school. And Jesus fucking hell, it was a terrible ass experience because seriously, the exam week at my school, that is not a regular exam week. At my school, an exam week is not an exam week, let's just say it like this. It is not an exam week because it is a fucking competition for every single teacher at my fucking school for a, for a title of the biggest fucking asshole at my school. Seriously, they are competing to become the biggest fucking assholes at a school and so goddamn annoying. If I could compare it to something else, it would be probably, imagine bowling. Imagine bowling where the bowling ball is like, is like an exam of a certain teacher, teacher one. And the bowling pins are exams of every, our single, uh, the, every single, our fucking teacher. And the teacher one is trying to hit as many bowling pins as it is ever fucking possible to fuck up the life of a student as much as he can physically what the fuck am I even talking about so though he let's just say the, the exam weeks were fucking horrific my school is a specialist at making you suffer I was literally sweating blood for all the past couple of weeks and I do not remember a single thing from the stuff that I had to learn or that I had to go for at school so yeah it was completely fucking useless but yeah it's over I survived it I'm going into the next year of suffering and yeah we are currently recording Terraria also if I remember correctly about like a week ago when I had the last episode of Terraria I actually wanted to kill the golem which as you might see I'm right now planning to do also I randomly found this guy over here Tom and what? Oh, all right. Um, I didn't plan to actually spawn him, but whatever. Let's lock down the potions. He also got stuck over here, which is quite interesting. I got no idea what the fuck just happened, and I didn't mean to get him stuck. Also, uh, I. Let's hope that I can actually damage his hand. I can damage it, but it's actually quite slow. Holy shit. He's going crazy, man. Alright, there we go. Um, there's an easy boss fight because of how fucked up this room is. Seriously, just look at it. He can't do shit to me. I didn't even mean to glitch it. What the hell? I genuinely didn't mean to glitch it. But yeah, I did. Alright. Oh, there we go. He dropped down. Finally fucking late. Oh, maybe this one will be become unstuck. Look at him, he's hopping, he's hopping slowly towards me, it's possible that he will become unstuck, that will be partially good and partially bad. Bad for a fact that the boss fight will be a bit harder and good for a fact that you will actually see a genuine fight with the golem. And he's almost out. I can't do shit against this, he just, the table got spawned in such a bad spot. Christ man. And 1000 HP left, there we go, second phase. He still has a fist. He was defeated once again. Oh, I get a sunstone. Exactly what I wanted, because I got a Neptune shell and I also got the moonstone, or how's it called? So let's uh, let's spawn him for a third time. Let's kill him once again and just because we can. Why the fucking hell not? Uh, it's also... I must point out one thing and this is that I don't know whether it's because of how much defense I got. I got 86 defense which is quite ridiculous if you would ask me. But he doesn't deal any damage to me at all. Just look at this. He deals like tens of damage. He doesn't deal like... 
50, 60 damage per head, he deals like 20 at most. Alright. Heat Ray. Oh, not bad. Oh! What is this? Holy shit. Alright, it's not dealing any damage because I'm not a mage. Alright, a surprisingly effective strategy, just going from one side to another. Alright, it's not gonna work like that anymore. I just ran into his fist. Alright, second phase. I'm never fucking farming this golem. I'm not even trying to beat him, I'm just farming him. And once again, another heat ray, come on. There's one item in particular that I want to drop from him. Want him to drop, and that is the uh, pickaxe. I don't know, he's dropping a certain pickaxe which allows you to mine the dungeon blocks because, yeah, I can really mine them out. I can only dig out the traps, but I can really get the blocks. Alright. It's actually three stages if I'm correct. Now that I'm looking at it. First stage where he does nothing else but just throw hit, throw punches at you. Second stage where he starts shooting lasers. And third stage, which is this one. It's quite an interesting boss, but he's really glitchy. I purposely didn't want to glitch it out. Oh! Golem Fist. Fist. Uh, that's not dealing all that much damage. Alright, <laughs> let's try to beat him with this. It's gonna be quite difficult, especially due to the fact that we ran out of potions. Alright, there is no chance in hell I'm defeating him with this. Oh, well, yeah, maybe I could, but <laughs> I'm, I'm not saying for that. I'm not saying for maybe. Alright. That has almost down, and there we go. I think this is gonna be the last goal that I'm gonna defeat. Hopefully it will, he will drop the pickaxe finally. Alright. They drop it, nobody dropped the soundstone. Another one. And in that one, boys to dust. All right, let's go back. Let's to, uh, let's go back to our house and let's craft ourselves a couple of new items. Also, how long am I recording? Only eight minutes. I defeated like five golems in this video already. All right. Um, where is this crafting at? I can already craft the beetle armor. There we go. This thing, beetle helmet. This gives me 27 defense. How much does this thing give me? Alright, so... What's the difference between these two? I do not really see a reason for to use this one. 3% increased damage. While increased movement speed and melee speed. I don't really feel like it's somehow good. I think that the 12... Defense is a lot better. I'm gonna get this. 12 defense is just so ridiculously good. Right, there we go. A last piece of my armor, and I got an 8 to 6 defense without an iron skin. That's pretty damn cool, man. Pretty damn freaking cool. Also, since I got this thing, I can. Where is it? I wanna craft out the upgraded version. There we go. Celestial stone and if I'm correct, I can also combine it with the Neptune shell somehow But for that I need a guide. Where the fuck are you? There we are. Colon. 
I need a moon shell. What the hell is... Moon shell, moon shell. Alright, alright. I didn't know what the moon shell is made of. But I do know that it's probably through Neptune's shell. Yeah. Moon charm. I need a moon charm. And for that, I would need to, to be... Oh, look at this. I got small little beetles flying around me. That's so cute. I need a full moon for werewolves. Ah, god fucking damn it. Someone's a powerful boulder. It's not like it deals any damage. It deals almost no damage at all. This thing could deal... A this thing could be actually quite powerful. A full on mage equipped. I could actually test it out. Oh la! What the fuck? What kind of a tooltip is that? Oh la! Jesus. I don't need two sunstones, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna start selling some stuff. I don't need a second one. I don't need this. I don't need uh, the staff. I don't need golem mask. I don't need spiky ball trap. I could use these ones later on. I'm gonna need this. This thing is actually quite gr great. As you might see, it increases your live re regen, defense, pick speeds, everything pretty much. It's like a second food buff. Just way too good. Wooden spike, why the hell not? I'm gonna sell it. Let's sell that shit. Nail, I don't really have a need for that. Is there anything else I don't need that I can sell? Philosopher Stone. Yeah, that's about everything I'm going to sell. I'm also going to sell the Bad Wink. There we go. Bad Wink. Now, what am I going to do is actually craft out the event summoning sort of items because I, I only got the solar tablet. The solar tablet which you can use for getting the solar eclipse. But that's the only item that I got. I also need to enlarge my storage room. Hmm. How would I enlarge it? That's a question. Ah, my nose. Alright. What do I need for that? I do not know, but I'm gonna sort out my items first. Because, yeah, I got kind of a full inventory. <sighs> Neptune shell. I'm gonna put it into one of the chests. There is nothing. Hermes boots. I don't need it. And is there anything else I do not necessarily need? I get one bizarre. I do not need two of them. I do feel like I do not even need this. Practically a bigger version of the heat ray, isn't it? I don't know. Oh, I also forgot to sell this thing. The golem fist. I'm also going to sell this. I got too many golem masks. I'm gonna glock this down because why the heck not? I could also sell these things because they are already useless. I already got this one. It's pretty much a better version of it. A little, uh, I also do not need shackles anymore. And alright, here I'm gonna put this thing. This thing. I don't need beetle husk. Do I need them for something? Give me a second. I'm gonna look around for a guide. Yeah, they are pretty much used only for these things and beetle wings. And I do not really want beetle wings. I already got a pretty damn nice looking set. Seriously, just look at it. So shiny. I could also sell this thing as... Whoa, that is a quite expensive thing. Alright. Uh, uh, I don't need the alchemy lantern. And... Last thing. Oh, and also the bezoar. 
Holy shit, I'm quite rich, man. I'm really rich. Just close these doors for no apparent reason. Alright, where is the reforged guy? There you are. I'm gonna be using these wings for a long amount of time. Arcane. Armor, not bad. Spiked, precise, arcane, brisk. And I ran out of gold. Arcane. Amazing. Yep, I ran out of gold. Should I have left it at uh, hard or how is it called? Plus three defense. Yeah, now I get entirely useless wings. Amazing. Amazing. <sighs> Alright. Uh, where did I put my magic Equip to you. I got no idea. I got no idea where I put it. I don't have a single idea where the fuck it is. Alright, now let's go into Terraria forums and let's find out how do you summon a pumpkin moon. Because seriously, I won't find it ever. Pump in moon. There we go. Pumpkin moon. I need 30 pumpkins, ectoplasm, and hallowed bar. Or I could alternatively get the frost moon event. For which I need a naughty present, solo fright, silk, and ectoplasm. I should have plenty full of ectoplasm. I get a lot of solo fright, uh, but I do not have enough of ectoplasm. Hmm. I get some silk, that's good. Where's my ectoplasm? I should have it somewhere, but I don't know where. Maybe it's, I sold it, which is quite unlikely, or I just made bars out of it. Either of which would be quite sad. Yep, I've got to farm it up. I've got to farm it up. So yeah, yeah, but before that I'll probably end this video a bit short. Or you know what? Can I get, can I get solar eclipse? Give me a second. Solar Eclipse. Nope, I can't get it. That's quite sad. Still though, I got pretty much nothing to do in this episode apart from going to the dungeon to get some uh, get some ectoplasm to craft a couple of naughty presents. So in the next episode, I can actually get into the frost 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 moon. Yeah, frost moon. Into the frost moon and kind of get a couple of items from that and get somehow prepared for another boss, which is the Duke Fish Run. So, yeah, I'm probably gonna end this video over here. Hopefully, you enjoyed it. If it did, give it a like. If it did not, please give it a dislike because I want to know whether or not I should improve. So, though, I definitely do hope that you enjoyed and yeah, you pretty much know how it goes. Like, share, comment, subscribe, but mainly please subscribe because I'm really fucking close to hitting that 1000 subs. There is the ice elemental. And yeah, hopefully I'll see you next time. Holy shit, I didn't even see this guy. Also, I should point out one thing, and this is it off camera, I was actually able to get the fire gauntlet. Not really get it, but I already had a mechanical gauntlet in the last episode, if I'm correct. Which is the predecessor of this thing, and this thing pretty much just adds fire damage to your melee weapons, which is pretty damn good. So yeah, yeah. But still, hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope that I'll see you next time. Also, I hope that you didn't mind that it was a bit shorter than usual. So though, hope you enjoyed, and bye.